Want even more details? Click the link for the full guide. As you're adjusting to keto, a handful of struggles are bound to pop up. So I thought I'd blast through the common ones with quick solutions to bust through the blocks. The first one, taking off the low fat blinders. Advertisers, books, the medical community, and just about every other human being on the planet has told us to stay away from the fat. How to bust through? Well, if low fat worked, it would have worked by now, right? So why not just give high fat a try? You can always go back to whatever you were eating before. Second is dealing with other people's low fat blinders. Not everyone has seen the awe-inspiring rays of the keto light. There are going to be naysayers around. How to bust through? Shh. Don't tell anyone. I know you're excited, uh, but don't shout it out from the rooftops. Let your results shout for you and go about living your life happily. The third, accepting that you were wronged. Food isn't just food for many of us. What we do and don't eat can often devolve into dogma and it doesn't have to be this way. How to bust through. Remind yourself that you aren't wrong or a bad person for the way you eat now. The medical community was wrong. You were just being really awesome doing what was suggested. Keto is simply a more well-informed suggestion that may in fact actually work for you. The fourth is worrying about your cholesterol. Of course you are, I was too, everyone does. Just a few short years ago, eggs were the devil. And deviled eggs don't even. Now they're one of the healthiest foods on the planet. How to bust through? Science. It's changed and it's at our fingertips. For example, the Women's Health Initiative, the largest controlled study in history, found absolutely no correlation between a low fat diet and a reduced risk of heart disease. Also, you can click. Want even more details? Click the link for the full guide.